I had found the D6 documents, but Miller had not yet returned. Without his help, I wasn't certain I could get out of the library alive, but everything depended on it. Check the documents you brought. I was put in charge of radio monitoring. Our hope was to contact the government bunkers over the Urals, but those bunkers were the first to be hit. At first, they didn't directly target civilians, and nobody thought this would be the war that would end it all. As I was monitoring the radio, I picked up a lot of weird stuff in the beginning, too. Siberia was silent. But the others did transmit, including the strategic nuclear subs. The subs kept waiting for orders. Should we hit them? No one could believe Moscow was not. <laughs> NATO captains were the kids on the air. Artyom, I'm Vladimir. Pick whatever you like. <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, I'm exercising, as you can see. I told you we'd meet again. It's a nice base the Rangers got themselves. I heard you received no help from Polis. What's your next move? Keeping silent, you're turning into a Ranger. Take a close look at the road you follow, Artyom, and be aware of how it might end. You reap what you sow, Artyom. Force answers force. War breeds war, and death only brings death. To break this vicious circle, one must do more than just act without any thought or doubt. Well, Artyom, 
I've been chatting here for far too long. It's time to go. Okay, 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 there's not much useful in here, just hints at most, although it does show the way to D6. Well, that's our destination then. Are you ready? So, how are we faring? Old man, is everything ready? Uh, the firewood's done. <laughs> Vladimir? The gear's ready. You guys? Ready. Settle up then. Bakunya. It's the old church dungeon. Get in. Ah, great. It's time to warm up at the stove. 